Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, I'm so close, I'm so close. Yo, what's going on guys, and welcome back here to episode 3 of our Power World Adventure. Uh, in between episodes, I haven't done a great deal, just grinded out a little bit and had a little bit of an exploration around. Uh, but I'll show you guys quickly what kind of pals we managed to get. Uh, this one here. Okay, so I went out and had a look, I found a Vixie, a Fork, <laughs> uh, Rushall, and spark it so yeah that was pretty cool let's go ahead and chuck some of these guys out and this one and i guess we'll chuck you in there nice we got the ball ball man on stone we could use him as a like rideable uh companion as well vixie looks like it's gonna be over there getting us some more wool which we don't really need um fork is transporting and so to spark it so yeah we might go ahead and chuck back in the cat at this way and yeah we'll leave the rest for now that's that should be good i went ahead and crafted up a few things so we got pelt armor now so that's nice and protective so that helps us out a little bit we got the stone spear finally and a crossbow so yeah we should be looking pretty well upgraded for right now we've also got a, a damp egg uh fully incubated so let's go ahead and hatch this one as well and see what kind of power we get oh we got a celery i did see this one so that was pretty cool apparently i have seen it out in the world i don't know where but there it is let's go ahead and replace it with you damn that's so cool that looks pretty sick but check out our character right now damn we out here bowling check us out Got a crossbow, giant spear. Yeah. Alright, I think we should go out and see how well this stuff works. Ooh, just before we do that, let's go ahead and build. We should be able to build ourselves a cooler box now. Awesome. Um, do we want it inside? Oh, let's just go check it up here. Two, one, and done. There we go, so we got a cooler box. I presume this will just make our food last longer. Once we have a pal that's over here, the ice one. We, I don't think we just took him out of the box here, didn't we? It's on the watering, but it should hopefully come over here and start cooling this as well. I'm not sure, but we also did go ahead and get the cherry rifle for uh, Tansy as well. So that's pretty cool. We'll go try out that as well on some people. Uh, as you guys can see here, this is where I ran to. So I ran up here, jumped through there, um, come back down and around. So let's go ahead and teleport over to the small settlement. I think I'm going to go to the travel totem. And we can see what's over there. Oh my god, that's a level 30 officer. Okay, maybe we don't want to be here right now. I feel like they are um, a little bit too high level for us. Let's just jump out of this area anyways and keep on cruising. Oh, of course, I don't have any food. That's not really what I wanted to do, but that's okay. Oh, we're down here on the map. I guess we'll just have a run around, see what's down this direction. If there's any new pals around or, or what the go is down here. But we did find an egg. Um, I guess while we're off, we can see how much damage this does. Damn, 1300 damage. That's nuts. That is so much crazier. Okay, what about the stone spear? Okay, let's see what the damage does. 41 I guess it's that little bit further away that it does actually... Damn, that was just really, really mean. We might better get ourselves uh, one of these Ds now, though. Oh, my God. Stop. Let's run. Let's run. I'm so nearly dead. Oh, my God. Go, 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 go. No. No, leave me alone. Come here. Let's go. Leg it. Leg it. <laughs> ah, I thought that thing was out me. Oh, my God. I didn't think that'll do that much damage to me. Jesus. Um, so now we can craft the Mega Spheres and the Sphere Workbench. Anyway, that's alright. We got the Sphere stuff now anyways. So we'll keep that an eye on that. Like, as we get back, we'll we'll go ahead and craft that one up. Get some of those Mega Spheres underway. So we can start capturing some better pals. Uh, let's just go out and grab all this stuff on the edge of the area. Uh oh, I think I did mess up. I glided into the thing and then my energy's gone. Oh no, 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 I'm so close, I'm so close, I'm so close. No! Oh, I died. I died. Well, that's sad. 
Okay, now I need to run all the way back and around there. Okay, got all our stuff back. Nice. <laughs> yeah, swimming just does not seem like a good idea, eh? It just like, just instantly, instantly takes all of your energy. Let's shoot the cherry guns. Damn, bro, you're not very accurate, but hey, that's alright. Hmm, it wasn't as accurate as I was expecting it to be. And all did that much damage. I think the flamethrower is still like the best little attachment thing that we have right now. But that's right. I'm going to try it out. I imagine they get better as you upgrade them. Dang, now that's one epic sunrise. <laughs> Check it out. I don't know where the hell this is. It's like in a giant ass bridge. I'm really hoping these people up here aren't that bad. If they are, I'm just going to have to try and run through them. So we'll see. We'll go have a quick look. See what's up. Over this way, hmm. Okay, there's a few defenses. There's something in a cage. You know what we might do? Let's, uh... Maybe we can back away for a bit. Yeah, it can't really seem to, uh... Come out this far. Okay, easy. Die. Die. One more. Easy. Okay. Can we get this thing? Let's go ahead and uh, release the power. We'll see if we're going to be able to capture it. Oh, yeah, we captured it. Nice. That's pretty cool. We get some coarse leather from these guys. and Oh, coarse ammo, sorry. Okay, well, that's good. So it's good to know that level 5s aren't that bad to attack. I'm presuming they're going to respawn, so I don't want to chill out here for too long. Okay, that was pretty cool. It was well worth the uh, checking out for them. Oh, we got direwolves. Oh god. Well, I didn't really want to defeat that one, but anyways. Yeah, yeah, this jolt hog. Bam. That thing kind of hurts. Oh, this one's left. Put out a pal. Damn. That's the first one I've seen as like an enemy pal. Is it maybe from level 10 the syndicate thugs can release their own pals? Or maybe it's just like uh, they just can do it randomly? Damn, okay. This is pretty big. So those little towers must be the like different regions uh like bosses i suppose like like the towers the syndicate towers those are camps obviously they must all contain their own pals all right that's pretty cool we got some stuff to build though so let's uh try and head back without getting distracted king packer level 23 we could probably get it but i want to see if you can try and capture them and i want to get some of those better spheres to try and do it because i feel like you should be able to capture these things but also, I don't know what I'm talking about, so that's that. Uh, I'm going to get this chest, and I think there's a teleporter up there too that we can go ahead and try and unlock. Alrighty, cool. We get a little, little run-down church here. By the look of it, a desolate church. There you go. Let's unlock the fast travel. Alrighty, so first off, I guess, let's go have a look at the new pals we got. So, we got Jolt Hog. The dire wolf. Ooh, the mu this mucrist. I wonder if it's actually really good. Um, just because of the way, like, it was, like, locked inside the little, like, cage and stuff. So it might be a better pal than normal. Okay, so with those last few levels, we've unlocked a few new building things. We've got a monitor stand and a viewing cage. Let's go have a look at how big these are. Oh, you know what we should do? We should chuck it out there. That's such a good idea. Right, let's go. We've got the high ground. We can watch over all of this stuff. Uh, let's go there. Open the settings. Okay, so normal work speed, movement speed, sand depletion amount, hunger depletion amount. Okay, so we can really make them super hard working or hard working. Okay, cruel, brutal. Humane. I'm just going to leave them on their normal work setting for now just because I don't want them to be super sad right now. Maybe one day we'll we'll burn through some of their... <laughs> uh, oh my god, this thing is massive. Okay, open. So the viewing cage, I guess... Oh, I, okay, I understand what this is. This is just a place for them to hang out and not do anything. So they just stay inside here. I can't go inside of it. Container for observing captured pals. Pals inside cannot participate in battle or production, but they do not become hungry. Okay, that's pretty cool. I might end up moving this, but for right now, let's just chuck out a 
few of these. The sphere workbench. I thought it was in the PAL section and I was like Kelly confused. Oh surely this will fit. Okay, let's incubate this egg and I might be able to swap the sides for them. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Okay, so we got the mega spheres and the PAL spheres. And last one, kaboom. Nice, there we go. So we got a mega spheres in rotation and the PAL spheres. And I gotta quickly rebuild this egg incubator. Okay, so we should be able to upgrade the base now again. Boom, max number of bases. We get two bases now. Hells yeah, build a cooking pot, build a wheat plantation, build a mill. Excellent. I don't think we had the uh, cooking pot. Did I see that or am I just blind? We can do the mill, we can do the wheat plantation. Uh, there's a heat. Oh, there it is. So 17 is where we're at. We also do have... I thought we had an ancient technology to upgrade. But we did also get the Nightwing saddle item, which I'm going to go ahead and quickly gather up the resources for that, and we can craft that one up. Okay, so I'm just running back up to the top of spawn just up here, because there is this copper chest that we should be able to open now. There we go. Feathered hairband uh -huh. schematic, even though I've already got it unlocked, but that's okay. Hey, there we go. We got the cat on the cooling job. Nice. So I presume this increases everything's lifespan. Oh, yeah, so much. Grab you up there. We should be able to make this saddle. Oh, my God. This thing is going to take forever. Oh, my God. It's nearly there. God damn. Acquire. Okay, let's... Uh, where you at, Nightwing? We should be able to ride you now. Oh my god, we can fly. That's so cool. Descend, raise, control, up, down. It is nowhere near as uh, good as I thought it would be, flight-wise. Oh my god, that's cool. I think so. Everything must have this air cannon attack. i launch that. Damn! Okay, so now I'm out of energy. I can't do anything. I'm just going to sit here. Okay, so let's go ahead and get the mill because that's part of our progression. Uh, the metal chest, more items, definitely, 100% need that. And I'm thinking that we'll go with the, the defensive thing for now. The mill. Okay, let's put this one on this side, I'm thinking. Flex flour into wheat. Or wheat into flour, sorry. Not the reverse way around. We don't have any wheat seeds. I don't know if we just haven't explored the right terrain to find them. <laughs> oh yeah, the wooden gate. Okay, let's get into a little bit of a building uh, time lapse and get this underway. covered most of the area like that should go to there they won't really be able to get up on that side which is no issue obviously that's still gonna be up over the top but for now I think that's okay uh, the building in this is kind of janky though like you build this one the walls stay flat but the door goes on a big ass angle which is weird and I don't like that the dire wolf thing it's like it's prowling the perimeters or something but it gets jammed up in things so yeah the, the building is quite interesting but it's okay for now. I think we got the basic idea of what we wanted to get done. Uh, we also do have this other egg ready to go, so let's go ahead and hatch it. Oh, another token. Uh, okay, so I think I just realized that the schematics are different. So this is the regular one you get, but the schematic I got requires ancient parts and is also an uncommon armor. So I'm presuming that that means that it is a better grade. And then we've also got the feathered headband schematic. So yeah, it requires that as well, but it is also an uncommon. Okay, let me build a large chest. Let's just build it out here. Noise. Yeah, yeah, much bigger. They are a little bit. I'll eventually swap out these for the as well, but yeah, for now, I think it's pretty good. They can just chill there. Common egg and... Oh, right, bunny. 
Alrighty guys, well we might go ahead and wrap up this episode just there. If you have enjoyed this one, don't forget that like button and subscribe. And uh, before I turn on the notification bells, because we will be uploading this quite frequently. I'm having an absolute blast still. Hopefully you guys are enjoying the series. If you are, let me know down in the comments below. And uh, yeah, I guess I'll be catching you guys in the next episode. Later.